HP Studios, in association with the PGA Tour, is delighted to bring you the second stop of the FedEx Cup playoffs. Today's coverage of the Trios Championship is about to kick off. Delighted to have your company for this third round action. Luke will be alongside Rich Beam, and Rich, this player has been playing some impressive golf. They've got the lead, they're where they want to be, but what should be their mindset going into this round? Well, hopefully it's not on the chasing pack because the chasing pack is filled with some big names. So they're going to have to really bear down, focus on the task at hand. They've got to sit there and keep their emotions to themselves and not get wrapped up in everybody else around them. Can't wait to find out what happens here. Let's see what kind of Tony sets for himself today. Time for the second shot into the first. Not a bad approach. Grab the putter from the caddy. You're dancing. And this has been a hole he's unable to take advantage of so far for this event. This is a good chance. Putting for par. Well hold, let's move on. He's currently sitting in first place. Time to tee off at the second. That's a good looking shot there. Chosen the pitching wedge here. Well, take notes, folks. That's how you do it. What an opportunity to make a birdie. If it's up, it could be in. That was a gallant attempt. And that should secure the par. Well done. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. 
Here we are in front of a par three. Going with a three wood here. And he's safely on the green with that shot. Outside chance here for the birdie. Looking really good. That'll help your scorecard. Well hold. That is definitely a confidence builder. I don't blame you. Worth another look there. sits in first position the play so far has been stellar increasing the lead Luke but can they maintain it let's find out lovely momentum for this player after that birdie at the last hole keep it rolling no point hanging on to that one you didn't hit your best there and John What's this one looking like? Oh, I'm not seeing a whole lot of ball in the sand here, guys. Let's see how they deal with this one. That's tidy. Oh, 13 footer coming up here. This one's dialed in. Some momentum being built now. That's back-to-back -back birdies. Kind of like it. Two in a row. He's feeling it. Our current leader is enjoying a seven-stroke advantage. And we've arrived at a par three.
going with the eight iron here. Oh, this one should find the surface. Good shot, this. This would be a great up and down. Oh, well played. Gotta say, his short game is phenomenal. Didn't have to sweat that power putt. Leading by eight strokes now after that hole. Let's see what happens here on the sixth. Oh, that was pure. Time for the second shot here at the sixth. <laughs> Getting ready to play their third. Playing their fourth shot. Well, that's very crafty, isn't it? Judging it beautifully. Well, this would be a great power putt if he can make this. Good putt, that. Still in the lead now after that hole. Deep into the front nine. Here we are at the seventh hole. Looks like this one's heading safely for the fairway. This spot looks awfully familiar. Didn't they play here yesterday? Same spot as yesterday, looking for the same result today. Opting for the five wood. And here we are with the third shot.
that one just missed the hole. This one's for Birdie. And that putt will drop, and he'll extend his lead. And this is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. And they'd be feeling buoyed with confidence after that birdie. Here's a good chance to maintain the momentum. This one might need to get down a little. Yep, give yourself a pat on the back. There's 17 feet remaining to the hole. It's on a great line. It was on a good line. It's just about three feet away. Well hold. And now that finds him in first place. Here we are at the final hole on the front nine. That's some good golf right there. Playing this one about 130 yards out. Wind is blowing from right to left here. Wants to work it against the wind. Choosing the 9-iron here. Now, yeah, good safe shot, this one. That should find the surface. Oh, that's well played. And a chance for birdie here at the 9th. Almost a gimme birdie there, Luke. Fantastic. Oh, that's frustrating. He's got a par out here. Let's see if he can make it. Well, that hole's behind us. More to play. And there's no movement on the leaderboard after that hole. Let's see what happens here at the 10th hole. Par 5 at the 10th. This hole is wide open. Tear high and let her fly. That's really not what we were looking for. Well, Rich, I'm being honest. This lie is putrid. Well, look, they birdied the hole yesterday. Good luck today on repeating that birdie. That's it. It's okay. Around 110 yards to go. Wind's blowing from left to right. We're going to try and hook this one in the wind to slow the golf ball down.
Well, that's well played and sets up a good birdie look here at the 10th. Of all the shots that I like the most, that one ranks right up there. Ouch, that hurts. Just three feet to the cup. And down it goes. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Teeing off here at the 11th. That'll work, that's fine. This one looks like it'll safely make the green. And hitting yet another green here in regulation. Dare I say, Luke, this player has been in fuego with his approach shots. Another green in regulation. Ooh, right by the hole. And with that, you can go and put a par on the card. And after that effort, this is how the field is shaping up. No movement up or down on the leaderboard for this player. Teeing off here on the 12th hole. I shot that. That should find the surface. That's just inside the range. 15 feet to the cup. You can mark it down. That's birdie number four today. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. You've arrived at a par four. Well, there's no doubt they'd have some positive vibes coming off that birdie. Let's see if they can keep it rolling. Didn't look like their best swing there. Second shot here on the 13th. This one is chewing fiber. Well, that's beautifully judged. Made birdie on the last, looking for a second in a row here. And he just keeps putting a gap on the rest of the field. What a putt to hold. Back-to-back -back birdies move in the right direction there, Luke. Currently in first position.
Welcome to this hole. That's a par four. This looks to be heading for the cut stuff. Second shot here on the 14th. Game of the seven. This one might roll into the rough. Didn't quite strike that as cleanly as they would have hoped. Not taking enough club to get it there. shot that one pretty good chance here this one's for par good stuff today especially the short game has been really sharp today that's a good putt for par you'll take it still in the lead now after that hole the honor is yours time to hit a good one here at the 15th Well, that's comfortably on the dance floor. Well played. That's an absolute ripper. What a shot. Well, good look at Birdie here. Go on. Get in the hole. Well done. Take the Birdie. is currently sitting in first place. This hole's a tough two-shotter, a long par four. Tough tee shot here, bunkers left, water right. Find the fairway or else. Not a bad line, this one. Looks like a similar approach to yesterday. They had a good result yesterday. Can't see why they wouldn't have another good one today. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. Should find the green here. Well, that'll work up on the dance floor. Could have been worse. And this one for back-to-back -back birdies. Oh, just missed. And they'll walk away with a par on this one. Let's take a look at the leaderboard. And this is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. We have a par four on this one. How much do you trust your swing? Go for it, and only 327, lay up. Bunkers right, water left. Second shot here on the 17th. Yeah. 
Well, that's a handy shot. Good chance this one, right on six feet. And mark it down, that's birdie number seven on the scorecard. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. Well, it's come down to this, the final hole. Welcome to the 18. Difficult tee shot, water lurking down the left-hand side. Don't hit it where the wild things are. Oh, well struck. This drive's heading for the fairway in my eyes. From around 220 yards. Wind's blowing right to left here, and they're going to go ahead and ride the one in here. Opting for the three wood. This one should find the rough. They're in the bunker. Got a chance to get up and down? Yes, difficult lie. Made a par here yesterday. A little bit more difficult today. Okay, step one complete, out of the bunker. Now let's go make a putt. And another round, safely in the books. And as the third round comes to a close, they're in that enviable position of top spot, Rich. Oh, it's been sparkling, hasn't it? It's been a pleasure to watch. It's got to be a little strange, though, having such a massive lead because there's only one way to go, and that's down. Let's see how they handle the pressure on the final round. Well, that just about concludes our coverage. I'm Luke Elvey, and on behalf of Rich Beam, plus all the hard-working folks at HB Studios, it's good night for now. <laughs>